everybody this is Connie and I'm gonna do a um, get ready with me kind of well it is a get ready with me because I've got a bunch of errands to do today I need to go to um, job service or Department of Labor as it's called now um, to drop off some stuff for my unemployment which could be weeks in the decision-making stages as it goes right now according to what the lady on the phone told me Friday um, so hoping hoping when I drop off today will speed things up just a little bit then I'm gonna if I have time I'm gonna go to social services and apply for food stamps um, I have to go get the bill for my car to take to my mom because she's gonna pay for to getting my car fixed um, that's as far as she'll go though she's not gonna help me with any of my bills or anything like that um, which, you know, I didn't ask her to, and I didn't ask her to do my car, but she said she wants to pay for that. So thank God for my mom. And then I've got to go drop off some packages. I've got two like this and two like this to go today. So, um, got to drop those off. I'm sorry to the winners of my giveaways. I told you I was going to get that stuff out Friday and I didn't. I um, have been dealing with a little bit of stuff so today I will get them out. I'm really worried about the postage prices but um, you know because I don't have I have very little money to my name right now so anyway um, got to do that. Uh, what else did I have to do? That's four things. I think that's about it for today. I can't remember. But I need to I need to get this done. Um, I've already I took shower, I moisturized, I um, put some of my conceal and corrector on. I don't know if it helped or not. You can still see that dark. But maybe it'll help after I get my my um, foundation on. I used my spackle for my primer. So I'm going to use my Infallible Pro Glow from L'Oreal today. I've only used this one other time and I really liked it. So let's shake this up a little bit first. Listen how watery it is. Usually it doesn't that much. I'm going to use my brush. And this is in the color 201. I cannot see. Some days are better. Oops, and I'm dripping. Better put the lid on here. Some days are better for my eyes, some days are worse. So, anyway, it's in color 201 Classic Ivory. on for my forehead. I really do have some oh, I have dry patch in between my in between my eyes right here. hope I haven't been leaning down too far the whole time. Even with my moisturizer, I'm still got a few dry spots, which doesn't happen that often. Okay, so that's done. I'm not going to I'm not going to do a ton of stuff today. Like I'm not going to use any concealer or anything. Um 
Let's do my brows. I have not used this yet. Um, I took it out of my drawer and just put it in my my brow drawers to use. So unpackaged it. It is the Maybelline Brow Precise Fiber Volumizer in Soft Brown. And if I remember right, this has got a really weird... Yeah, it does. So I have no idea how this is going to work. But I'm going to try it. I should try this on a day when I'm not going anywhere, but... wasn't too bad. It smears though. That's not too bad. It's pretty dark for a light brown. Yeah, my skin. I don't know why it's so dry right now. I have an eyebrow hair here. Well, for a light brown, this is really dark. Pretty dark, huh, guys? Oh, well. It'll have to do. Okay, I'm going to use my Ulta Eye Primer. Okay, today I am going to use my Lorac Pro um, 2 palette. It's the second palette. I, um, this is not real. This is a fake palette. Just to be really upfront with you guys. This is what it looks like. And since I'm going out on errands. I am not going to go too out there today. Um, let's see here. Let's use this buff color. Or all over the lid. It's pretty pigmented. I, I'm thinking it was my uh, Pro Palette 1 that I used, my fake one that I used. I won this in a giveaway from um, Brandy oh, a year or so ago. And uh, I won the big palette, the big blue palette, and these two, Pro 1 and 2. And the big palette, I did not like whatsoever. It, um, I just didn't like it. But these two here seem like they're okay. All right, let's get, find a buffing brush here. Crease brush. I have too many brushes in my deal. They're too hard to get out. to get rid of one at least, huh? Okay, for my crease, I'm going to use the light brown. And I'm going to do what they, what I believe is like the halo thing that they're talking about. 
I think that's what this is anyway. If not, I will look it up tonight. Today when I get home sometime, if I can remember. That is really light. Doesn't look that light in the palette. This is called Cool Gray. I'm going over it one more time with that. Even though it doesn't look gray, it looks brown on the palette. Okay, for my eyeshadow shade, let's see here. Let's go with the uh, rose, I think. That's really pretty. Kind of a rose gold That's what it looks like. pretty color. I just pulled a brush out of my regular eye deal, so I'm using the elf brush. Okay, I'm just going to go over that with my over this again, kind of blend those two together. I just wanted a real real subtle look for today. I've got a couple of palettes that I haven't even used yet that I've been kind of saving. I was saving them for a while, so I'm going to do um, do looks with those maybe later on in the week. Okay, so I used this color here for my base. This, wait, I used this color here for my base. And then I used this and this for my transition crease colors. And then I used this for my eyeshadow color. Okay, uh, mascara. I don't even have mascara. Oh, yeah. Let's use the um, Revlon Volume and Length Magnified by Revlon. I uh, have just pulled this one out of my drawer also because I got rid of a few, so I pulled a couple ones out there. I've got like four or five in my drawer yet that I haven't even opened. At least four or five. look powdery on my eye but they're not moving anywhere because of my primer but they sure look powdery on the eye okay but I have mascara in my hair need to get my bangs done again, but I'm afraid to cut them myself because I made such a mess last time. But I also can't afford to go have them done. And I'm also going to see my eye, my how much my nails have grown over. I need to take these off because I can't afford to have them put back on again. Of course, the minute I decide to have them to do my um, fingernails again, then I lose my job.
Yeah, I'm getting a little bit panicky because my rent is due the first. This is the last week of the month and I don't have a penny to give her. Oh, I forgot to tell you what I was even using. For my my blush, I used the Jealous Blush. Wet and Wild Disney. Isn't it Wet and Wild or is that Elf? It's Wet and Wild, isn't it? It's by Disney. That's all it says. And this is what the blush looks like. Very pretty. It's got sparkles in it. And then I used my Physician's Formula um, Translucent Pearl for my, this is the packaging, for my highlighter. It's not the best highlighter. It's probably one of my least favorite highlighters, but that's okay. Um, and then I'm going to use the Ulta Lipstick in Romance. And it's just a, it's a, it's a full-size lipstick, but it came in a kit like this. See, it's a, I think it's full-size anyway. And it is a nude, but it's pretty. It's it's a nudie, more of a nudie brown, I guess. So that is my face today. And you can still see my dark spots. So I don't know what to do. What do you guys, you know, if I had any money, I would probably get those, the new e.l.f. Um, corrector sticks and try those out. I've heard that they are... Um, the salmon color is the color that I need to color my dark circles. And I also need something to color um, my cheeks get a little bit red right in here. So, someday. <laughs> anyway, I'm glad you guys joined me. And I am off to run my errands. It is after lunch already. So, I'm Doctor's getting a slow today. start. Even though I have no money, I have to do something. I need help. So, um, go to him, talk to him about disability, talk to, you know, whatever I can do. I can't hold a job, I can't, you know, I wrote him, wrote this thing out that kind of sums up. You know, it doesn't say, it's nothing, it just says that I can't hold a job, I'm um, tired and no ambition, all that kind of stuff. You know, just kind of my symptoms all lumped in to one huge paragraph. If you like this kind of video, the get ready with me's and stuff, please give me a thumbs up and please share my video. Thumb, giving thumbs up and sharing helps so much in the way of getting the word out to people and I certainly do it for you. Okay, talk to you later. Bye-bye.